I'm going to tell you one of the biggest sins in the world today is sexual immorality. It doesn't matter whether you're homosexual, heterosexual. Sexual immorality is, listen, sex outside the bonds of marriage. I'm not talking about something homosexuals call marriage. That's not holy matrimony. But, but holy matrimony is when one man and one woman stands together before God and they're married in the eyes of God. It's called holy matrimony. Homosexual crowd, they can have the same-sex marriage, all that. But God doesn't recognize that. And God is the one who created marriage. He is the one who instituted marriage. And he is the one who defines marriage. And he defines it as one man and one woman freely and totally committed to one another for life. That's marriage. And so anything outside of that union, holy matrimony, any sexual activity outside of that union, it is sin. And God's calling, he's calling it sexual perversion. And God's calling you to repent of that and follow him. And you say, but my passions are raging. Well, that's fine. But your passions ain't nothing to the wrath of God when it comes. And it's not just a threat. It is a warning. It is an awareness. It is an understanding that God is going to pour his wrath out on all those who suppress the truth of God to chase after their passions and their ungodliness. But realize God has a way and it is a right way. And marriage, holy matrimony, is God's way for men and women to enjoy the wonderful pleasures of sex that God created for a man and a woman who is joined in holy matrimony before him. I want to encourage you, give your life to Jesus before it's eternally too late. Come on, y'all. Let's follow Jesus.